Okay, so this is just going to be a short tutorial regarding auto splitter stuff and where to find it since my old one is like slightly outdated. Um, why am I trying to eat something while I'm making this? I'm an idiot. Okay, so uh, let's start with um, in most cases, and especially as time goes on and the game is updated less, um, you will be just fine going into here. Uh, you right click on your live split, going to edit splits, and then in the top, make sure you have Left 4 Dead 2 written in, and it will say load removal and auto splitting are available. Click activate. And that's it. As long as the game is open when you do this, when you click activate, or you open live split with this saved as activated, uh, and the game is open already, then it will hook. And in here, it'll say game version. In this case, I have the release version of the game here. Um, and the settings are fine the way they are. You don't have to touch anything. Um, now, in the event that uh, there's game updates coming out and you're trying to run, like the only reason why you would need to do this is what I'm about to mention is if you're trying to run on newest and the auto splitter isn't updated for newest yet, um, you can just, uh, I okay, so, I will try to keep this as updated as I can um, for as long as it's relevant. Um, but basically, and I'll have this in the description, uh, but uh, this is where I have the updated auto splitter stuff before it gets merged into um, Bill Play 3's repository, which is where the file that you get from activating edit splits is hosted from. Um, and so you just go over to releases and you just download this file. And then in live split, you go to uh, edit layout. And then you add uh, control scriptable auto splitter. You add this, um, you double click on it, and then you just select the file after you download it. Uh, the, it's, the settings and everything are gonna be the exact same and all that. Um, yeah. Uh, you don't have to do this. Um, it's only if you just need to get access to the like the newest version before it's like uh, officially in live split through activating and edit splits, and uh, yeah, that's it. Um, just a small thing to note. Um, if you're in the auto splitter settings, um, if it doesn't say a game version here then it didn't detect your game, and so it's not going to work. And also, if you're having, if it seems to be working as in it splits um, and ends and everything, uh, but it's not automatically starting, just check and you start logic, and then save and reopen live split. Um, and if all else fails, you can also try running live split as administrator, but I know uh, some people would disagree with that as being a solution, but it has worked for some, so yeah. Uh, if you have any questions, just ask in the Left 4 Dead Speedrun Discord, which can be found on the sidebar in speedrun.com, Left 4 Dead 2, and Left 4 Dead 1 pages. Um, I assume if you're watching this video, you're already in there. So yeah, and I will link uh, this uh, GitHub repo in the description, or rather the releases section. So yeah, that's it.